In this video, we're going to look at some of the best OSINT tool repositories. Now, I regularly look at and review OSINT tools on this channel, so if that's something that you're interested in, do hit that subscribe and like button. Let's get straight into the video and look at the first OSINT tool. Everything is linked down below in the description. The first one we have is Cyber Detectives OSINT Tools Collection. Now, just remember, I haven't personally created these. I'm simply looking at what's online already. So do have a look at the creators and contributors for all these repositories, as they probably work on other things that you'll also be interested in. So what do we have within the first OSINT tools collection? Well, you can see they've simply categorized everything that they have. So you can look at specifically maps, geolocations and transport, social media, domains, IPs, images, messages, code, search engines. There's literally all sorts of information there. Then you can scroll down and have a look at them individually. So if you're interested in social media, whether that be TikTok, Twitter, Twitch, YouTube, Instagram, literally have it all. Just as an example, you can see if we click onto Duolingo, something you might not even think would have an OSINT tool, but it does. And it's a language learning platform that has over more than 570 million users. So you can imagine the amount of information and data that's in there. And all you need to do is simply click and you'll be directed to the tool and the information on how to use it. So really, really useful. There's lots of tools on there for platforms you wouldn't even think. You can search for any type of data that you're looking for. All the information is included and you can simply just follow the links through. We've got Facebook video downloaders, Twitch video downloaders, everything in terms of OSINT tools. It's really useful. I've been using it over the last few days just to check it out, especially the domain and IPs because that comes in really useful for investigations. We've got things like site docs, crawlers, filefish, lots of useful information when it comes to investigating malicious emails or if you're just simply trying to find something via OSINT. The next tool or repository we have to look at is Aware Online. Again, linked down below if you want to check it out. They have a people search tool, username, email address, phone numbers, websites, companies, geolocation. Again, lots of different types. So I highly recommend you just give it a go and it's free to use. It's not something you need to pay for. You can simply visit and type in any type of data you want and get it to check. As an example, you can see the type of drop downs we have in email addresses. We can look in different platforms and it tells us there if it's free to search or if once we click on it, it's paid. So if you're really interested in the free, it's nice and easy to just do that beforehand rather than go through clicking into links and find out that it's paid. So they have the links to all the perfect information gathering tools, depending on what you're looking for. If you're simply looking for an image, click image and we can then do reverse image searching for Google Images, Bing, Yandex, TinEye, it's all there. So I highly recommend that you go and check this one out. Then moving on to the final repository that we have, it's simply labeled Awesome OSINT. So I think that pretty much describes what you're going to get, a curated list of amazingly awesome OSINT tools. This again is another one that will have a very long list of different tools. So depending on what you're interested in, you can quickly get to that section. We have general searching, meta searching, file searching, paste bins, coast search, Reddit, Tumblr, LinkedIn. If you're looking at specific social medias, domain and IP research, image searches, image analysis, offline browsing. So lots to get your head through. Just having a look at what we have for people investigations here. You can see a variety of different links, whether that be face check ID, crunch base, mug shots, reunion, lots of different tools that you can definitely try for email searching, things like Blackbird, Dehashed, email format, lots of different tools that you can easily go through depending on what you're looking for. And there's a quick description there as well, so you don't have to click and find out what it's about. You can quickly just read the description on the right hand side to find out what it is you're clicking into. So another really useful repository that I recommend you check out if you're looking for some sort of investigation or cybersecurity investigation. If you find these type of videos useful, do join our Discord community. We have lots of information in there, whether that's specific cybersecurity or OSINT tool research in general. 
If you enjoyed the video, do please leave a like down below. It massively helps the channel out and it tells me you're enjoying these type of OSINT tool videos.